Hi everyone! I'm so excited because today I was at the flea market and I can tell you that this was my best ever haul. I have found tons of very nice things, all the things what I've been collecting. So I'm very excited to show you all of them. These are in this bag and uh, um, all together it cost me about $20 I think but the real price of these are over than a hundred so that's why I'm so excited about these and everything is in pretty good condition so let's start it first I have found some new plushies for my collection this was the first one this is this very nice huge nitty plushie which is um ladybug and it's a super duper expensive one because of the size and this is super big so I don't know um, maybe it's about uh, 40 I uh, maybe maybe about 40 dollars I don't know but the prices here are quite expensive um, and this one is so adorable, fluffy, beautiful, perfect condition and it has got the newer tech so it's not from the 90s, it's a modern version and it's perfect for springtime. Um, the second one I have found, it is also a plushie, it's a cute little polar bear and this one is so adorable also a big one i have another from this collection which has a blue scarf with dots on it i have got smaller ones but this one is so big and imagine it was only two dollars oh i was so excited when i found this one so cute okay moving on I have another plushie. This is a dinosaur. So cute little one. It also had the tag on it but uh, I have removed and this one is very 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 adorable. Going to be perfect for my boy dolls. And there is also one. Yes, here is a gorilla. Yeah, this one is going to be Lainey's and it's very adorable with this little hair. Oh my gosh, it's so cute! <laughs> okay, I have also found dolls. Uh, I am concentrating on finding Barbie dolls from the 90s because this is the only place where I can find, you know. And I was so happy because I have found this girl and I, I know her um, because of looking at her earrings so maybe it was an Avon doll I, I haven't checked the net um, about the names yet but I'm going to do it and her hair is very nice because she still has these uh, I don't know what um, things in her hair and she's really pretty look at this little face so cute and she still has her ring, so I'm very happy. Um, she got a bracelet, but I can remove if I want this. So this is one of the dolls. And I have also found this Midge doll. I think she's from the Camp Barbie collection made in the 90s, but I'm not sure, so I have to definitely check her. But I can rarely find any Mitch dolls. Her head is not in the best condition. Maybe that little bit of plastic which is inside is broken, I'm not sure. But um, she was three dollars, so no she was one and a half dollar because together they were three dollars so i think the price was perfect i don't know if i can mend her leg uh, maybe it's just glue around it um maybe not it will turn out when i'm going to clean her and uh, but i think finding a new body is easier than finding these heads and her hair is very nice. I love the color, good condition. So, 
super cute and after that imagine I have found two Barbies which are in amazing condition and they also have their real outfits this is the oh, maybe school Barbie I think she's wearing this pretty skirt she still has her real necklace and earrings and she has got this ribbon around her head maybe it is also the mm, how to show you maybe it was also on her head but she's in perfect condition very nice long hair i already have this top but mine is not as good um, as this one and she has her very nice skirt and I can find her a pair of shoes but her leg is also in perfect condition so I was so happy about this doll and she was about uh, four dollars so quite a good price and the other one was in a box so I think that's why it is in a perfect condition so I don't have to clean her I can just display this doll and ta -da! look at this girl oh my gosh so here is my other doll um, I don't know the name of her but she's beautiful she's wearing this very nice uh, pink uh, what is that like a hat um, she has this cape but I think you can make it to a skirt if you want to um, her real dress Here's also her ring and she's wearing this belt and it's still in perfect condition. Look at this one. So no scratches, uh, no marks, anything. And she still has her original very nice um, tights. I think these are tights or, or I don't know, maybe stockings? Tights. Ow. Um, only the shoes are missing, but no problem, because she is perfect. I couldn't believe my eyes when I saw this doll. And imagine, just a half a minute after I got this doll in my hand, another lady was looking at it, and I knew, just looking at her face, that she also wanted this doll. But uh, as I bought it, um, it is mine now, so I'm very very happy and the man also sold lots of Barbie clothes I don't know anything about these so maybe they were um, the Barbie Avenue um, fashion clothes or maybe they are the part of sets I'm going to show you so this is the first one it's very nice I love this color and it also has the Barbie tag in it and they are in amazing condition so that's the most important thing for me because not only just finding these um, clothes is very difficult here but also finding them in perfect condition so that's the second one and it has got this old-fashioned uh, button on it maybe it also has a tag or not I don't know no no tags so that's the second one then I have found this dress this striped one so that's also very nice then I have a pair of jeans Um, I have this blue mm, nightgown with ruffles here and I think this one had the Barbie tag yes this one has hey it's there it says Barbie fashion so maybe they were the one sold separately I have checked eBay and there are lots of clothes in uh, brand new box condition so I'm pretty sure that this is a skipper dress um, I'm going to see it because I have got one or two skipper dolls which uh, don't have clothes then this was a kind of 
tropical skirt thingy I think this is what you can put uh, on uh, a swimsuit then I have this blue I don't know what is that sleeveless top or skirt I can use it whatever I want to um, do for it then I have got this kind of top that's the back I have this dress yeah it's also a genuine Barbie one mm -hmm. then I have this one and by the way I already have this one so I know that this is a part of a fashion avenue dress um, somebody just put this on it I think it looks nicer with it oh because it sparkles so it's very elegant and nice then I have this yellow dress um, this blue what is that swimsuit I think it's a swimsuit blue and coral color what else there were lots of things there so I tried to um, find all of the genuine Barbie ones and I wanted to look for those uh, which are the collectibles but I think I have found almost everything from the bag and this is a very nice green dress yes and maybe that was all I don't know no I still have some yeah I have found these pink boots and I'm very happy because I have a Ooh, what is the name of that doll? I have a Barbie uh, which doesn't have these pink shoes so I'm very happy to have these and this one also says Barbie on it that's very nice and I have found a pair of trainers I was so excited about because I don't have any of these so these are really adorable cute little ones and i also found in in a blue light blue color so oh these are so 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 cute so i think these are all the things what i have seen there yes after that I have found a knitting magnet, a tiger magnet, I love these and I have got an Ikea um, bookcase so I put all these on it and it's a very very cute one and the best thing I have found is here I have got still some little things but I'm going to show you this dolly because I was so 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 excited about this one this is a Sylvia Natterer Minouche doll and uh, now she makes these dolls for Kate Kruse and these are hand painted beautiful ones and so expensive because the prices start about 100 euros and above and this doll is so pretty and imagine the lady who sold her um, buys uh, things from Germany and then she comes to Hungary and then she sells these and she asked only phew, it was about five about five dollars 
for this doll and I also got a Funko figure I'm going to show this to you later but she is in amazing condition and she has got ginger hair you know my favorite one and look at this little amazing hand how well made it is oh my gosh perfect condition they have full vinyl body and so tiny little legs so definitely i will need a pair of shoes for her but also the clothes for these dolls are about um half of the price of a real doll so very very expensive and she is wearing not her original outfit this is a buyer um doll doll dress and this is called the dirndl and a fashionable very nice uh, uh, fork dress what german and austrian people love wearing and i love these these are so beautiful when they have got any holidays or celebrations they wear these and also when you travel through Germany into little villages you see that they still wear these clothes also in everyday um, very nice ones mostly um, elderly people love wearing these and they look so elegant and so pretty in these so look at this one it's so beautiful and I have got a few tiny things so this is the Funko Pop figurine um, it has got some problems with the neck but my dad is very good at preparing everything so he's going to do this for me because this is how it would have looked like and if I know it well or maybe if I think it well this is a figurine from the Lord of the Rings stories but I'm not sure Anyways, I was very happy to find this because I need lots of things for my um, boy dolls, um, for my boy room. And these are pretty rare to find and very expensive. So I haven't found any on the net, just in stores. Then I have found one thing for my Monster High doll. This is the little pet for my Rochelle Goyle doll. And I don't have these and i have found one little pet shop figurine which has sparkly ears and so cute i can remove this but very cute i am very happy to found these and uh, please write me in the comment if you know anything about the barbie clothes because i don't know and i don't know where i can find any information about these i am very happy that i could share my joy with you so thank you for watching and have a nice day bye bye